Rotational energy management is one of the hottest topics in motorcycle helmets today. Uh, it's really grabbed the, the public's attention and for good reason. Rotational energy damage is the worst that you can have for brain injuries. And the whole job of motorcycle helmets is to make our sport safer, make it more plausible that a rider is going to walk away from a, a get off of any kind. So about four or five years ago, we developed the first subverter, the MX-470, and we, we worked in conjunction with a third party uh, manufacturer that had a rotational energy management system. And this is it right here. You can see it's the largest slip plane ever created. Uh, the whole idea was that it allowed the helmet to move around the rider's head. So if there was an impact, the helmet could, could move forward, allowing the rider's head to rotate more slowly, which protected the brain. The MX-470, you probably have heard me say it before, Amazing helmet, built-in flexibility, uh, built-in built energy management, and energy managing flexibility. This system, uh, absolutely the safest motocross helmet to date that I'd ever seen, until now. This is the MX-700 Subverter Evo. This has Advanced Rotational Energy Management, or ARAM, a rotational energy management system designed by LS2, simply better by design. No mechanical device involved, but it just uses better design to allow the helmet to rotate properly, and it beat the original 470 in the ECE 2206 rotational energy tests by 2 to 25 percent. The numbers don't lie. Advanced energy rotational management from LS2. Every helmet you just saw passes the ECE 2206 Rotational Energy Management Standard using ARAM technology, advanced rotational energy management developed by LS2 helmets and available from an LS2 dealer near you.